we're asked to find the partial derivatives of the given functions. To determine the partial derivative of f with respect to x, we consider y a constant and differentiate with respect to x. To determine the partial derivative of f with respect to y, we consider x a constant and differentiate with respect to y. For the first example, we are given f of x comma y equals two, x to the power of negative six, e to the power of three y minus x. To find the partial of f with respect to x, we differentiate with respect to x, treating y as a constant. So the derivative of two x to the power of negative six, e to the power of three y with respect to x is equal to two times the exponent of negative six, x to the power of negative six minus one, which is negative seven. And then we still have times e to the power of three y because we're treating y as a constant. We treat e to the power of three y as a constant. And then we have minus the derivative of x with respect to x, which is one giving us minus one. Simplifying, we have negative 12 x to the power of negative seven e to the power of three y minus one. To find the partial of f with respect to y, we now treat x as a constant, and differentiate with respect to y. The derivative of two x to the power of negative six e to the power of three y with respect to y is two x to the power of negative six, which we are treating as a constant, times the derivative of e to the power of three y with respect to y, which requires a chain rule. The derivative with respect to y is e to the power of three y times the derivative of three y with respect to y, which gives us times three, and then minus the derivative of x with respect to y, which is zero, because we treat x as a constant. Simplifying, we have six x to the power of negative six e to the power of three y. Our next function is f of x comma y equals three x to the power of 3.2, y to the power of 7.6 plus 32. To find the partial of f with respect to x, we treat y as a constant and differentiate with respect to x. The derivative of three x to the power of 3.2, y to the power of 7.6 with respect to x is three times the exponent of 3.2 times x to the power of 3.2 minus one, which is 2.2. Because we're treating y as a constant, we still have times y to the power of 7.6. And then plus the derivative of 32 with respect to x, which is zero. Simplifying, we have three times 3.2, which is 9.6, x to the power of 2.2, y to the power of 7.6. To find the partial of f with respect to y, we now treat x as a constant and differentiate with respect to y. The derivative of three x to the power of 3.2, y to the power of 7.6 with respect to y is three x to the power of 3.2 times the exponent of 7.6 times y to the power of 7.6 minus one, which is 6.6. .6. And then plus the derivative of 32 with respect to y, which is zero. Simplifying, three times 7.6 is 22.8 giving us 22.8 x to the power of 3.2 y to the power of 6.6 .6 for the partial of f with respect to y. I hope you found this helpful.